Hello students. Now many students have asked for the different types of projects like grocery shop and many others. So today I am showing you the grocery shop project using both that is binary file as well as CSV file. So first here you can see binary file I am using here. So any menus, any information you can give here. So I am using here all the functions. So first we will require, I am using here import sys because at the end I want to use sys.exit. Even if you don't use it, then also it will run. Then import pickle because I am using that file. So I am writing here import pickle. This you can write at the top also. So here I will just, I will write at the top here import pickle because this is my that file. The next one I will show with CSV file. So here you can see I am using here import pickle and then I will use here pickle.dump and pickle.load method. Now information about your project whatever like supermarket or grocery shop or cosmetic shop. So here you will give all the information and then the calculation part these things you have learned in 11th class. So same things you can just keep on adding the modules. Now for binary file what I have used here, I have used here a dictionary and like the old one like student I have shown you railway, airways, bank, same method I have simply used here only the difference is the name of the dat file is changing here. This is your grocery dat file and this is your grocery dot dat and the next thing is the datas. Here the data is in grocery shop. I have used here item number, item name, rate and quantity. You can calculate the amount by multiplying the rate and quantity. Like here the net amount I have multiplied the rate I was knowing and into quantity. So it is giving here the net amount. So simply you have to dump the file. So dictionary is having all your contents. You dump in a file. So you will write in a file. Dump means to write. And then when you will close it, so this writing work will be over. So in writing, we are using here A, B, A for append, B for binary. Same way in display also, like the old one you have written, same method. Try and accept I am using because end of file error it will show. So I have used here try accept block. And in this one by one, I will simply read and I will display. Next is your search, same RB mode, I will open it, read mode. You can see the old videos, You in detail it is explained. So all the old videos, bank management system, those you can see. So each and every line, only just now you have asked about the different types, how to change one project into another that I am showing you. So only the name of the file I am changing. So I can make multiple projects like this, only the data and name I have changed. Clear. So here it was bank dot that I have changed into grocery dot that and the data is only like in grocery I have taken here item number, item name, rate and quantity. Clear. If you are suppose using here cosmetic dot that then cosmetic number, cosmetic name and the rate and quantity will be there. Same way. So here this is your search. It is searching the data. Now menu driven program. So main program I am writing here. This is my main program. And in this, all the different functions which you have written at the top, you will call one by one. And at the end, sys.exit will be there when you want to exit. So the output will be like this, grocery shop, all the menus will be there. If it is choice one, it will show all the information. Clear? So all the information it is showing here. Then choice two, it will calculate the net amount. Then writing in a file. So here you can see a dat file you have created. And permanently it is there. So you can open Excel and you can see this dat file. You can take the printout of the dat file. So using display function, you can display all the data of that dat file. You can add any item anytime. And you can, this is to search. So for searching, I have used here four and it is searching the item. So you can just check here. Suppose I want to display all. So what you have to do here, four you will write and it will display all the items. Then if you want to search here, search is five given here. So five. Now suppose you want to search three. Maggie, you want to search. So item number is three. It will show here. You can see here it is showing the Maggie details. 
clear and if you want to search some other item suppose you want to search your biscuit so four number you have to give here it is showing all the biscuit details this four is a menu so for searching five first you will enter then the item number should be four and it will show here all the biscuit details it is showing clear so this is using that file that is pickle and the next one i am showing using csv file so ip students and uh, cs students both group you can use the csv file now in csv file all the old one you have already seen how it was running same way only the name of the project i have changed here and same here item number how many item and name of the item and price Okay, so here this is your CSV module to display the same function only the name I have changed here grocery and for searching same thing with which you want to search suppose I want to search with the item number or item name that you have to take from the user and then you have to search the item and average price also they have calculated here mean price so here this is the menu one two three four five and then if your choice is one it will ask how many elements to enter and you are entering the data so it is writing in the csv file one by one see it is writing here like this many datas if you want to enter then you will enter there how many number of items two so two you have entered here dal and maggi so it is showing dal and maggi also clear so this is your program and this is your output you just go through the other programs so how to change it whichever project you are taking you will change the name of the file if suppose you are taking a railway railway.csv bank bank.csv and the datas you have to change okay you go through the program you just run it and see the other also there are many other different like cruise management system inventory management stock management student management school management library management same thing here you will write library dot csv undo sorry so you will write here library dot csv and then you will like here grocery one i have kept the name and this was writing in the file so this is writing in the file yes so grocery one i have given the name you can give your own name of your project and then you can run it so just design it and if you have any doubt then the other projects i will uh, share with you you can just simply subscribe it so that the other new videos i will daily i will upload one or two projects so you can just go through the project if you want to design any of them you can simply design it and you can design the practical file also thank you have a nice day